What's up guys, I Formulate here. Welcome back to another episode of Three Scary Games. Today we're starting off with Flocked is the free to play horror game on itch.io. As always, you have the option to donate, which I recommend. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Okay, click to view notification. Thanks for coming. I know socializing is not really your thing. Still can't believe I'm gonna be living with you. Don't even pretend like you don't got a crush on me, cutie. Whoa. Hey, how do you think it went? What, the block party? Yeah. It was fun, what you mean? The old guy seemed kind of uptight around me. That's Giles, he's uptight around everyone. You think I made an okay impression? Sheesh, you always do this, laugh my ass off. Sheesh! It's not like it was a performance, people just wanted to meet the new neighbor. Everyone loved you, don't worry so much. Thanks man, haha. <laughs> okay. When are you off work? Midnight, FML. See ya then. Very interesting text. See you then. <laughs> Velma, thanks for coming, Ray. It was so much fun getting to know you. For real, for real. Glad to have you in the neighborhood, pal. Thanks, everyone. Excited to get settled in. Your dog is very loud. Sorry about that. He's usually quiet. He's just getting used to the new place, I think. You need to put a leash on him. I have a cat. I forgot to pack the leash in the move. I'll pick up a new one on my way home from work tomorrow. See that you do as soon as possible okay we're in the office now oh we're at work we're in our little cubicle saw how giles was talking in the group chat what a dick Pa, ah, is he always like that pretty much you off today nah same shift every day this week 3 to 12 well, what's a rough shift sounds ass yeah it is ass oh boy <laughs> my body was like it's ass. Sounds like ass. Must be getting home. Were you, what, two feet tall here? Interesting camera angles. What apartment do we live in? This apartment is spooky. I love what the developer did here with the camera angles. Whoa. What? Is that our dog? It's the cat. Oh no. Oh, the dog killed the cat. Oh no. Hey, we gotta talk. Yeah, we fucked up. Our dog. Oh no. Hey, sorry, my Karen is super busy at the store. I think Rex killed Giles' cat. <laughs> oh no. I love him. Why the fuck did he kill the cat? Why was his cat out in the hallway anyway? Are you into me, Raymond? What? I'm not sure I understand. There don't have to be any strings attached. It's just sex. Animals eat, sleep, and fuck. It doesn't have to be any more than that. No, thank you. Giles, there's something I need to talk to you about. Don't bother. I saw your dog run off with my cat limp in his mouth. This is awkward. I am very sorry. Nothing can be done about it. It's done. I love that cat, and yet I feel nothing. I am numb. Giles, if there's anything I can do, anything at all, please let me know. Well, he's probably going to kill our dog. I am thy mate. I am thy man. Goat of thy flock. I am gold. I am god. Flesh to thy bone. Flower to thy... Okay, he is just spamming a poem. He is spamming a poem. Hi, Velma, it's Ray, your new neighbor. Okay. I don't care about Velma. I don't care about Bradley. Hey, Bradley, it's Ray. We met at the block party. Do you know how much... Do you know much about Giles? He's been sending me some weird messages. This game is pretty neat so far. No one's responding either. Gee, what's going on? What the fuck is wrong with Giles? You always do this. I don't think it's me this time. Hello? Are you home already? What just ran? Oh no. Fetch my heart? What? What? 
What was that? I gotta fetch the cat's heart. What is going on? They're already in there. Maybe we're not supposed to be up here. Supposed to be going here. Fetch my heart. Um, why was his heart up here? Whoa! The fuck was that? What? Here you go, little buddy. No forgiveness. You all right there? I mean, your guts are kind of just hanging on the floor. I heard a door like open, like unlock. Oh, it was this one. Are we outside now? Is that a billy goat? What's in front of us? What is that? Oh no. I don't trust this at all. I don't trust- What the fuck? Just happened. What is going on? I'm not gonna look behind us, I'm just gonna keep running. Oh, it's black smoke chasing us, that's great. Evidently you're not supposed to look behind you. Looks like we're finally getting to the end here. That's always a good thing. Oh, I don't want to look at you. Appease me. What? So, that was Flock. Short and sweet. It's very sweet. That game was had a lot of potential. I love how it actually had an introduction. I had a story to it at first with all the text messages. You got to learn about the main character. You got to learn about your friends your friend Giles was a little sus there but that was awesome it had a lot of good horror elements and definitely gonna donate but I'll leave this game games link down in the description below and let's hop to the next one so this is Dia another free-to-play horror game and curious to see what this is one's gonna be about because you go I guess we're gonna be searching the town of Dia. That's cool. The main menu actually just starts you right up. I love how there's a population sign. It says one now. Assuming it's us. That's pretty cool. Giving me Silent Hill vibes off the bat with the fog. Hello, sir. Are you alive? Well, the population was too before that guy. Uh... I don't know what happened to him. There's this little sus gap of a note here. Thank you for your contribution to the city. Oh, you're welcome. You know, I didn't do much. I just joined, but you're welcome. I appreciate the note. Population was two. You. I don't know what happened to him. That was very suspicious. All right. Anyway, we're going to continue ahead. this little message on the side the, the monster didn't find me inside the tower we got a little radio here it looks like 
A radio? It seems to be working, but I can't hear anything besides static. Silent Hill static? I love the fog, I mean... Oh, man. What are you doing up there, buddy? How did you get up there? That's a dramatic fall. Once again... I don't trust the static so far. Okay. It's it's a dead man. It's a dead man. What am I saying? But if, if anyone is out there. It's a dead man. Don't touch the body, okay? Looks like we need a code here. I don't know what the code is, unless we know it already. Hell can anyone open the gate? I don't know what I'm doing here. Coming fast, okay. It said there's zero people in the city before I entered. Are you outside the city? Well, she's inside the city now. Hello? Um. What? No! Oh, you gotta I'm click here. the text. You gotta there's click the text. I didn't know that. A body after me? Alright, I'm not even going to look behind me. Can you shut the gate? I'm in the center of the city. Get over here. I am it's I'm not coming. Safe outside. Jesus, dude, what were you thinking coming to this place? <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, what are you doing here still? That's my question to you. If this place is so dangerous, what are you doing here? I love the atmosphere so far in this game. Not much going on. I mean, the buildings are pretty much the same. The same dude, just he just likes to fall. He is just planking. I mean. It's just playing dead. It's pretending so we can get closer to you. Oh. It's also pretending. The voice of Dia will like guide you. Well, it's pretending to look like a human, so it's not actually a human. It's not very nice. I love how there's signs on all these walls on these buildings saying the population is one and two. Where's he at? Another body gonna fall from the sky. What kind of building is this? The sky is pretty plain. The sky is just white. That's pretty suspicious. Population one. What happened to the other guy? Oh, there he is. He fell. Saying not to get close to the body. Well, we're just going to walk on top of him. <laughs> Very interesting. Very slow-paced horror game so far. Um, Almost like a walking simulator. He is creeping up on me. I don't like it, man. Stay back. Is he, like, walking to us, or is he just, like, slithering around like a snake? Like a sneaky snake. Where are we going? Are we going to the center of the city? I sure hope so. So, loop. The heck, this looks like the same place we just went. No, I guess not. I see you. Do you see the tower? I'm in here. Come quick. Do I see the tower? Oh. I see it now. Stay right there, buddy. It might. It might what? It might not hide itself anymore at night. What? She's very suspicious. I don't trust her. Please come fast as I slowly walk. This tower is so far away. I'm trying to move as fast as I can. 
Population 2. Again, I don't like that. Where's he at? Did you see that red thing in the middle of the tower there? What is that? Maybe just red lights. Okay, it's just glowing. The whole tower is just... Why is she at this tower of all places? Like, I guess there's a gate here, so maybe that's why. I just want to know what she's doing here still. Why hasn't she left? Like, where's her food supply? You know, what's she eating? It's locked. Yeah. I'll unlock the door. Yeah, unlock it. In fact, you told me to get here fast. I did, and the door's locked. Like I'm. <gasps> Hurry up! Hurry up! He's getting closer. Come on. You actually came here. What the fuck is that? So she definitely tricked us. She... Thank you for your contribution. To Thank you for your contribution to this city. That's awesome. That is so cool. So it was her. What a liar. I knew she was very suspicious. I'm not done with you yet. I'm not I'm done, done with you yet. yet. Snake B. Snake B, Snake B, Snake B, Snake B. What? What? Okay, so that was Dia. Short and sweet again. Uh, more like a walking simulator, but it was good. I enjoyed it. Uh, didn't have too many horror elements. It's not a typical horror game you'd expect. It did have a nice atmosphere. I do like the little... I, I love the ending there. Thank you for the contribution to the city. I love that. But yeah, that was the yeah, Go check it out. I will leave a link for this, this, this game's description down below as well. And let's... Hop to the next one. The last game we're going to be jumping into is a point and click horror game called Blackwater. I'll leave a link down in the description for this game as well. It's free to play too. All three of these games I played today were from Scare Jam 2020. Okay, this is pretty cool so far. Definitely a different type of horror game. I wonder if there's a... Let me turn the volume down real fast. Alrighty, we back. I had to turn the volume down a little bit because it was definitely too loud. Um, hello? Alright, let's go to the ship. This is cool. I love, I don't play many point-to-click horror games and I'm definitely excited to play this one. Oh man, it's spooky. It's a spooky click to play. Oh my god. I think she's wanting me to give her something. Which is understandable. Okay, let's go right. Oh, this is spooky, man. I love how spooky this is. Um, can we do anything up here? Looks like she wants something, so maybe we go back up here and maybe we can make this work. Oh, we got a gold coin. Let's give her a gold coin. Oh, that's so creepy. Oh, what? A tentacle? What's the tentacle for? Why did I grab that? Maybe we go back up here and... What's the tentacle for, though? Um, can 
Can I use the tentacle anywhere? Maybe we use the tentacle here. I don't know. We miss anything else down here? It's so creepy. I don't trust you at all. I don't trust you at all. There's gotta be a way to use this thing. Right? I thought we use it here. Oh, we use the tentacle to open the van, okay. Oh. Oh, this is so scary. I don't know where we're going, I'm lost. Oh no, I'm lost. <laughs> Hello? What is that? What? We got an eyeball. Maybe we need the eyeball to scan. Yeah, yeah, look at that. Was this the gold? <gasps> Did you just kill us? I think we just died. Did it take our helmet? Or what? I am so confused on what's happening. We just got poked by the spider looking thing. So that, that was another short and sweet, very sweet point to click. It was made during the scream, not the scare jam, the scream jam 2020. But that was very good. I wish there was more to that because that was a lot of fun. That was actually kind of creepy. That was very creepy. I love the idea of being un underwater in a like a ghost ship. But that was very good. I wish there was more to it, but if you guys did enjoy this episode of 3 Scary Games, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one.